I'm really excited to turn the tables on Jason Massive from IDT. Very excited to have you here for a short question. Um, what's new in the lab space and what do labs look for when they buy a mill? Well, we do a lot of uh, a lot of research in that regard. As you know, we have our iNavigator issue that uh, compares specs from a number of different mills. Um, and I was actually just sitting in on some education yesterday um, talking about mills, and I think it really just varies as to what, what labs are looking for what. You know, there's, there's no one mill that's perfect for everybody. Um, as, as you guys know, you have different mills that suit different laboratories. And, you know, there, there's um, whether you're looking for um, speed and production, um, whether it depends on exactly what kinds of products we're doing. And then, it, as, you, as you know very well, um, a lot of the, uh, the newer features with the disc changers and that kind of thing is, uh, is definitely hot. Fantastic. Thank you so much for sharing your insight. <laughs> Thank you for having me. We're very excited to welcome Ali Tavasoli here today. He's an industry expert who's been working with VHF machines for the past seven years and has also been involved in regulatory validation and university studies for VHF machines. Ali, you have experience with uh, several other machines in the market. What makes VHF machines stand out from the crowd? What I really like about these machines are consistency, durability, and uh, predictability of the results. These things are very, very important, especially when you are working for a validated process. Uh, for example, producing customized abutment uh, for in a dental industry. And uh, validating these machines, we always got astonishing results. And uh, especially comparing to their size and price, uh, the results you get, it's always beyond expectations. And uh, we, were, we have been always happy with those. We appreciate you stopping by. Thank you. Sure. That's all from New York, guys. See you at the next show. Christine out.